All right, hello. This is Marie Diary. Sorry about that. Um, here to do a video. Um, if you're not already subscribed, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Um, you can watch any videos, other videos that is currently uploaded. You can like the videos. You can subscribe. Um, but yeah, before I get into it, my spirit guides, my angels, my archangels, my ancestors of the highest white light, I ask that you come in to guide me, protect me always, including when I'm doing videos and readings on this channel or anything that I do on this channel. I ask that you give me the clearest view of this reading and this video through the cards that I decide to use and have in my hand. Hands, I ask that you return any and all negative energies from people, places, and things, including ill will intent sent towards me. I ask that I ask that it's returned back where it needs to go immediately, permanently. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Thank you. All right, so I don't know how do I start off this video, this reading. Um So I'm getting this sense that um, people are still being drawn towards this person for their own personal gain or intent. Like a person could be having people coming from all, from all um, angles or whatever. To come at this person for whatever their intent is. Um, and this person is not taking the bait. Um, this person is dealing with people do I want to say dealing with people at surface value? Or they're dealing with people with what they need to deal with them for so it's like if it's something that's some kind of business situation they're dealing with them with, for that and like nothing else they're not looking to deal with them for nothing else they only looking to deal with that person or these people or whoever this is they only looking to deal with them for that what what's needed and nothing else like this person is they're not looking from anything else from these this part the other person or these people but these other person or people they're looking to come at this person for their own personal gain or intent um and this could have been going on for a long time um yeah like even people that's coming towards this person could be like in a marriage or they could be like in some kind of they could be coming in by by the by by the two by two by the number of two um they could be coming towards this person like at every angle and they coming in by two like them by by times two like times two they coming in towards this person but they're coming in towards this person for their own personal intent for their own personal gain whatever this is and like I said this could have been something that's been going on for um a long time um and then they're getting mad at this person because this person is not like choosing to take some kind of offer or bait so they're these these this these the person or these people that's coming towards this other person they're getting mad and upset with this person they're getting frustrated with this person because they're not accepting something yeah because i don't know it's like something about what these people are coming in towards this person they want to put this person in like some kind of poverty or they whatever they're doing they're trying to cause this person to be to um like cause them to end up in poverty or something like that whatever they come in for this intent is excuse me is it has to have this person off, worse off than what they are now like because this person could be actually doing very good or very okay 
or feel okay or whatever. But these people that's coming in, their intent or their what what they're trying to gain, it's not um, it's not uh good. It's like it would cause this more person more pain and more burdens than what they've been coming out of or what they haven't been dealing with, like as of like recently or lately. Yeah, something about unexpected money. So like I feel like these people maybe these people feel like yeah message of concern this could be a message of concern for this person yeah you got message message of concern you got courtship and you got marriage and you got family room so it's like this definitely is being discussed that this person is they're they're of high honor in some kind of way high honors at the back of the deck but this person is being discussed by these different people because, like, these people that's coming in towards this person, they definitely are trying to, in some kind of way or something, court this person. Whether it's, like, a male and a female or it's two males or it's two females or whatever this is. But it's, like, it, it's something with unexpected money can have something to do with it. Um, But it's, like, these people... These, the person or these people that's coming in towards this other person is for their intent or their gain for them to gain something. Yeah, child, whether it's like they're trying to think of new ideas to try to gain this. Yeah, these people within this community, which, you know, to steal from this person, to have this person like in like despair or bad health or just have this person like not not themselves because you got thief bad health and you got despair so it's like them coming in towards this person and then you got adjudication at the back of the deck them coming in towards this person and this could be being done by um something with a wealthy man could be significant because you got adjudication house and wealthy man followed by gift um but these people in this community who are coming in, who are coming in by coming in towards this other person, but in like coming in towards this person by the uh, number of two, like two at a time. It's like to have this person where they're in despair, like to come in towards this person to cause problems, to have them. Um, in like some kind of four of swords or uh four of cups to have them leave them out in the cold like this is their only intent to come in towards this person because because the, the, somebody's doing some kind of equal give and take with them like they're being these people in this community they're being offered stuff like oh you go do this and then i'm gonna give you this or you go get this person, get them to do this or get them to accept this or whatever. And then I'm going to give you this. Like, this is what these people are being offered um, at this time. But since this person is not taking it, taking whatever this is from these people that's coming in by the number of twos, they're, they, the people, these people in this community are getting mad because they're constantly trying to come up with new ideas, new ways to have this person um not be not not be the not be within themselves that they are right now like this person could be um you know highly independent on depending on themselves they could be doing a lot of stuff for themselves they not you know they could be not dealing with a lot of people or they're not in a, they're not dealing or interacting with a lot of people, places, and things. And this could have these people in this community or these these come these people that's in this community coming in by, by the tools. They could have these people um very bothered and upset, even angry and mad because they're not getting away with something because they want to do something. They want to get they 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 looking to do something with this person you got community and thieves so they definitely looking to do something with this person 
to take something from this person. This is what they've been wanting, they've been trying to do, they've been wanting to do. And this definitely has something to do with money or them receiving some money. Like, or they want this person to be in despair of not getting some kind of money or some kind of outcome, whether it's financial or or something else. But they definitely this is what they they've been working on for a while. And it's like this person is not they're not taking some kind of offer or something like that. Or they're not taking this bait that, that's being given. And it really has these people um, in their feelings. Like, they're definitely... These, these people are really feeling some type of way. Yeah, they're most highly... They most definitely uh, feeling some type of way. Because maybe um, they would have been more able to have this be accepted in the past when this person was more open to something about this energy but like i guess since this person has not been open to this energy or they've been really um like they've been really strict on allowing something so it's like it's really bothering these people because they're not able to get something done they're not able to get something um something completed or something that something completed something done they're not they're not able to complete the task something like that but what do we need to see from this deck to clarify this energy i don't know if i want to do this reading too long but let's see yeah these people are in this energy are definitely emotionally detached there there's no feelings involved what else for this energy that's out here surrounding these people in this community yeah, wow, we got vengeful. So these people are not only emotionally detached, they're very vengeful for whatever reason with this person and what they're trying to do. Yeah, it's very suspicious um, or suspiciousness. Some, so something definitely about this is suspicious with these with this um, these offer or these bait that's. Um, that these people in this community or these because you got community and thief out here so something about that is definitely suspicious that's why i feel like this person is not really acceptable to take in whatever these whatever this is or whatever these offers is because something is very has a lot of suspicious surrounding suspicion surrounding it yeah we got possessive yeah, but these these people in this energy is very possessive about, you know, and it's kind of like cling, they're clinging to this person in some kind of way, shape, or form. They're very clingy to this person because possessive, it says, you're clinging on to someone or something way too tight. Learn to let go. Love has no ownership. Everyone has free will. So they're very clingy towards this person, but they're being clingy towards this person because their whole intent is they're coming in to try to sabotage this person in some, way, some kind of way. Had this person caught up in some kind of way and they're not able to accomplish it like they might have been in the past. Yeah, they're being very, these people in this community or whoever about, whatever about this energy is very inconsiderate. Yeah, they're only thinking about their feelings or what they're trying to get done or accomplished or they're only thinking about themselves you got yeah like i said they could be very upset and like it's bothering them it's making them mad quick tempered is at the back of the deck followed by egocentric and um superficial self-absorbed yeah arrogant wow that's a lot so yeah these people are most definitely like in their feelings or feeling some type of way because they're not able to, whatever they trying to been trying to do because like i said this could be going on for a while um they're not getting it done and then like when they come in towards this person if they already know this person um they're so ir they're so bothered and everything like the person that they're trying to do this to or trying to get into their energy to do whatever they're trying to do the person will speak to them and they're not even like like usually they'll they'll speak to this person 
they'll interact with this person. They're not even doing that. They're like trying to, um, you know, ignore them or like they're, they're mad at them. Or like I said, they're not, they're not getting something done or something is like really bothering these, these people in this community. So it's like, they don't even want to be bothered with the person because they're not able to get done with their able to get done so since they can't get done what they want to do they don't want to have no interaction with this person for whatever reason like but they making it like they making it like it's the person's problem but it's not that person problem it's just they're not able to they're not able to do what they want to do so they don't want to interact with this person like so since they can't do what they want to do with this person they don't want to have no no interaction with this person they don't want to have no involvement with this person let's see yeah yeah to come in and cause confusion conflict and confusion you got two cards of these two different cards of someone having their hand up to their head basically i feel like this is basically the same thing the five of swords and the, the um despair card yeah basically the same thing they want this person to be in confusion about some kind of something some kind of offer or something they want this person to be emotionally confused about what they're trying to do and this bot is bothering them because this the person is not allowing these the person or these people to do this yeah ten of judgment ten of cups so it's like um Judgment is being called on these people because they want to disrupt some kind of fulfillment that this person has going on right now with this despair and bad health out here because, you know, they're trying to have this person be without or, yeah, look, Queen of, uh, excuse me, Queen of Swords is out here, but we got the Ten of Wands. Yeah, so you got the Ten of Cups, Ten of Wands, so it's like... Judgment is being called on these people because they want to change. I feel like they want to change this person's Ten of Cups to the Ten of Wands. Like like I said, this person could have been coming out of a lot of stuff. Or, or these people know that this person is not dealing with a lot of different people, places, and things right now. Because of whatever reason and... Since these people can't come in and do what they want to do, and they feel like this person is having some kind of ten of cups, they want to affect that and change it and make it into this ten of wands. So you got the ten of cups to like change it and change it into the ten of wands, like because, and they don't want this person to know like. I feel like where this is coming from also we got the three of swords coming out with some other cards because these ten of, they want this ten of wands to bring this person in despair be heartbroken because they won't know where it's coming from or they feel like it'll be coming from a, um different places yeah look the ten of swords so you got ten of wands ten of swords something that has been being done for a while is like these people come in and out of this energy or this is also what they've been trying to do to this person have this person being come out of this come they've been doing this to this person coming in and out of trying to cause this person um problem something about 10 10 10 could be significant i did see 10 10 uh earlier or whatever before i got on here and i also did see 12 12 so something about both of those could be significant but it's like these people in this community they definitely been going in and out of trying to change this person's ten of cups in whatever kind of way because they don't like it like it's like i said it's literally bothering them they're emotionally detached they're um, possessive, being very clingy, and not in a good way. They're not clinging to this person in a good way. They're only clinging to this person because they want to come in and cause despair. They want this person to be in bad health. They want to come in and steal from this person. 
take and take something from this person. Take this person's um joy or whatever like that. Yeah, look, seven of swords. Ooh, it just fell out. But yeah, and then the hangman. So they definitely want to steal this person's joy or whatever they got going on. I'm gonna take that seven of swords. But you got the page of cups, the seven of cups, and the six of swords. It's like they don't want this person to walk away from whatever these um choices is or these illusions that they're bringing in towards this person they don't want this person to, to walk away from that yeah they definitely been rushing in towards this person because they want to steal from this person and they're getting mad yeah look eight of cups three of cups coming out together three of cups they definitely getting mad because they feel like this person is not letting something go through or they not letting something happen and they constantly been rushing in towards this person you got all this night energy out here yeah you got the knight of wands the seven of swords and the knight of you got the knight of wands seven of swords knight of swords uh all this night energy like also what i got before i came on here because i was been picking up the energy with it too is like the song even though i'm kind of like upset with 50 cent right now but this song definitely relates to this energy right now you got the song mini man wish death by 50 cent if you haven't listened to that song go listen to it um but i feel like that that song definitely has a lot of significance to this reader um so they could even be this is why they're getting upset because they could have even been wishing like that on the person and they've been all these different people been trying to come in yeah knight of knight of pentacles wanted to come out um yeah like i said this has been over a, a long period of time that they've been like this is all what yeah and this uh, something about this is being exposed or enlightened to this person that these people coming in towards this person like they could physically and literally see these person yeah look sun devil card this person can literally see how these people change when they're trying to do something but then when they're not getting it done like they can they literally see this changing with these people and it's like it's the it's like the flip of a switch how these people are changing with this person or you know one minute they'll be like all trying to be nice and da 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 with this person then the next minute their their face is getting scrunched up or their um yeah their face is getting scrunched up they're making different um size and whatever that I did that and or they something something's coming out their mouth where um you know it's like they trying to say something subliminal i just seen 23 24 on the clock like they're trying to say something subliminal and like the person is catching on to it that you know they're basically trying to be funny you know just different stuff um so it's like it's irritating them it's bothering them they're pissing them off it's making them mad it's like if you, like earlier also way earlier today um cuz it is after 12 but way earlier yesterday um i was like thinking like if you could just strip these these individuals these energies down to their soul you could see all the different um different monsters or different be beings that they are and like you can see you'll be able to see who like what it is like and some of them are very like very like you know creepy scary demonic or whatever you want to say or just negative and then you know the other ones will be more more pleasant and like um calm and kind of like uh I don't want to say goofy, but like, you know, com like comedic, like, you know, a good com comical energy or whatever. But yeah, it's like because they're not they're rushing it to have this victory with, with some kind of sneaky deception of energy. And it's not happening because they definitely want this person to be in regret. 
Like they either they want this person to be in regret about a relationship or regret about some kind of financial situation or some kind of whatever this unexpected money is or whatever this unexpected money that this person got going on. They want this person to be um, in regret or about that or crying over spilled milk because they're secretly sneaky, sneaky, sneakily coming in, rushing in towards this person to have um, some kind of quick victory to change this person's um, fulfillment. With them definitely being in, like, yeah, they're standing their ground. They're standing their ground to do this. Like, I don't feel like this has something to do with nothing, like, um, or, yeah, it do. It's like, it's even if it's something where they're coming in towards this person trying to make an offer of, like, something uh, sexually or, like, relationship-based, and this person's not taking it, so... There, yeah, look, Ace of Pentacles, Page of Cups, it's like it's making these, it's pissing them off because this person is not taking some kind of offer because they know the person is knowing that these people or this person, is, these people coming in by the number of two, they're only coming in to steal something. That's their only intent, which will have this person in despair, which will have this person in regret because they're, they're only coming in to steal lie cheat still whatever they're coming in to be sneaky and deceptive like they're coming in to like basically kind of be like the grinch you know coming in to um you know do that type of energy like that and then you know leave without a trace or whatever yeah eight of wands coming in quick to have this victory or this is what they was choosing to do yeah they was choosing to do this they were putting a lot of work in to do this because they felt like they was going to receive something out of doing this. Uh, lovers, Seven of Wands, Seven of Pentacles, the Ace of Pentacles. Now, I don't feel like this has nothing to do with anything romantic, but like not nothing seriously romantic, but something coming in to act as if and then just to just like to carry out the... um. To carry out what they was, you know, set out to do by whoever or whatever. Because something, like I said, something about this is suspicious. Something about this is, like, it's off. It has a lot of, venge it's like, it's more vengeful energy than anything. It's not nothing, like, that's genuine. It's not nothing that's, um, oh, I want to jump on this right away. Or I'm willing to, I'm really to, uh be on this right away like no it's not that because this person has been seeing through seeing stuff you know and noticing things how these how a person or whatever would change yeah how a person's feelings or emotions will change towards them yeah because they want something to come to an ending or yeah queen of cups they want something to come to an ending like they'll come in trying to act like they're emotionally um have feelings for this person but only to come in and to act as if they do and to for it to end up very quickly or to end up in you know like i said in regret yeah ace of swords yep and they've been thinking about new ideas about this all the time whether it's to come in and to um get in this person's energy they get them where they get them you know making them believe that they care or whatever make them feel like um they understand this person but only coming in to steal something they're only coming in to steal something that's the whole because there's something vengeful about this energy something vengeful and suspicious about whatever this is it says suspiciousness is the qual suspiciousness is the quality of distrust and disbelief. Give yourself reasons why you feel this. So somebody definitely they don't trust this person. That's why they're being vengeful. Yeah, four of swords. Like they they coming in because um of whatever. 
something is bringing them in towards this person because they don't trust this person or they feel like this person did something. Yeah. Yep. Ten of Pentacles, the moon card. Something that this person, they, they haven't healed from or they're choosing not to heal from. Or they don't want this person to heal from. Something that they're do definitely doing in hiding. But I, like I said, something about this is coming out. Now you got the moon. Yeah, because they've been trying to manipulate and manifest something. These people in this community to whatever they're trying to steal, they've been trying to manifest this. And I feel like this person has been getting some kind of signs or... You know, some kind of signs or something. Most definitely some kind of signs from these people or whatever this is. Yep, that they've been putting a lot of energy into doing something. To try to carry out something, to try to succeed in something. And I feel like the whole time all these people could have been working or these, these people that's coming in towards this person... In some way or another, another, they could be all working together. Yeah, this definitely could be something in the current. Coming in trying to play mind games. Let's see. Let's see what else come out from my basket. Um, it was energy. Because they most definitely is... They definitely mad and irritated that they haven't been able to succeed with something. Like this person will try to speak to them and, you know, be cordial and whatever. And they'll just like, they'll just brush this person off or they'll, they'll all of us out of nowhere, they, they got an attitude or they're, they're, you, you know, bothered or irritated. It's like, what? Like, how you just you know, shape shift, you know, that's this, that, that's the energy of these people. They shape, they are shape shifting real, they so fast. And this person is like, like, what is going on? Like, what is this? Yeah, you got um, Mars talks about action, movement, passion, drive, vitality, confrontational style. Yeah, they definitely want to be confrontational with this person. Self-initiative, perseverance, assertion, and courage. Like, they don't like that this person is um, taking the self-initiative to do things a certain way or go about doing things a different, like, a certain way in a certain and different way. Yeah, they don't like that this person is taking the self-initiative to stand their ground because they only wanted to come in and ruin this person. This is what, the, what they want to come in and steal is ruining this person's reputation it says intentionally trying to ruin reputation because they something about it is vengeful and it's been suspicious like them coming in could have been you know for not everyone but half it's been like very suspicious um and something behind it has to do with this vengeful energy. You got five days. So something about five days is significant. Like maybe something is coming out in five days. What else to clarify this energy that's on the table? Yeah, they know this person. Like something about this person having an old soul is why... They are they don't like this about this person. They don't like that this person is like um could be wise in some kind of way. Yeah, because somebody could have been something about this, somebody could have been making something to look like something is not. It says made to look like something you're not, or they've been trying to make that person look like something they're not. Um, uh, we got moral standards, we got fired. So they could have been something about trying to get this person fired. They've been People have been coming in to do that, or when I said he's coming in by the by the twos, they've been trying to come in and get this person fired in some kind of way. Yeah, I see raccoon. Raccoon talks about disguise, um, tricky adaptability, uh, resourcefulness, and training. 
I don't want to. I'm. I don't want to mispronounce the other one. It's dextrity, or D E X T R I T Y dext dextrity. Yeah. So somebody, um, it says no filter with what they say. So them coming in trying to um cause something or change something. They could be somebody that has no filter. And like with them being like that, it's they're um they're very vengeful or they're angry in some kind of way or something. Yeah, something about an X is significant, whether it's the letter X or like a literally a X, like an X partner or whatever. We got vengeful. It says find a uh a better way to heal your anger. This negative emotion comes back full circle. Yeah, you got secret phone. We got prayed on. So it's like these people coming in to pray on this person or this ex is sending these people in by the two to pray on this person. Something about a secret phone is significant because that normally don't come out a lot, but something about secret phone. Yeah, we got his thoughts. I see his thoughts. So it could be an ex that's in their thoughts male or female but it could be a male oh wow so and we also got x move back in town or city so it's a lot of male energy coming out so something about an x or this uh this x could be sending people in by the twos to with this vengeful energy now we got four days or maybe somebody could have moved back in town four days ago or something like that. Yeah. You got um, Simon Says. So it's like this person could be telling, like I said, telling people to come in and do something. That's what I'm getting. Um, yeah. Yeah. So this person could be like heavily in their their feelings or whatever yeah somebody is not acting alone they're not acting alone whatever this is somebody is not acting alone what else to clarify this energy on the table we got eastern star eastern star is is, is the largest fraternal organization in the world so something about an eastern star uh group or organization is significant it's uh, the world to which both women and men may belong. So something about Eastern Star is significant. What else to clarify this energy that's on the table? It says a lie don't care who tells who tells it. We got send love light and keep it moving. I feel like this is what this person has been trying to do. Yeah, they've been playing in this person's energy. Yeah, or they could have been sending people in, in to play in this person's energy to see what they can get away with or see what they can they can yeah. And they've been trying to act like they've been playing it smart, playing it smart. What else to clarify the energy that's on the table? What else to clarify the energy that's on the table? Anything else to clarify the energy that's on the table? We got nail to the coffin. We got lifetime movie energy. I see um, snake. We got childish. Yeah, something. This person been knowing that something ain't right. He says, I sent a few people. It says, I sent a few people to know, I know to watch you see who or if you're talking to someone. Exactly like what I said. It says, boy, keep as a boy toy. Yeah, playing games. Yep. So we got playing something with playing twice. We got playing games, childish. What else was the other one? Playing it smart. Playing in your energy. All this playing energy, childish. Heavily childish energy. That's why all that night energy came out. I see the letter S. So something about the letter S is significant. I'm getting selfish from that. Anything else to clarify this energy? 
Yeah, because this person could definitely be somebody who's quite reserved. Or they can have, like, a side of them is there. They can be quiet and reserved personality. I see apartment. Anything else to clarify this energy that's on the table? I see Saturn. Saturn is time, maturity, challenges, wisdom. Yeah, they've definitely been trying to cause this person challenges. Uh, something about this person, wisdom, has been enlightening them about whatever this is. We got discipline, responsibility, excuse, excuse me, goals, ambitions, grounded, and experience. I feel like this person has definitely been grounded at this time, dealing with all these different people coming in their energy trying playing coming in our energy playing in our energy we got first house it says identity personality ego self image um uh, beginnings consciousness appearance and temperament so something about this person's identity and personality could be having these people come in in this vengeful energy with them being emotionally de uh detached um and like, you know, in this clingy energy, this uh, um, possessive energy. Yeah. Because they, cause they want to carry, they want to get something carried out. And they want to, I feel like they want to go back to somebody and let them know when something is carried out. It says don't want, yeah, and it's like too, they don't want this person to exceed some kind of new bracket new tax bracket it says don't want you to exceed to a new tax bracket hater on steroids yeah something about it is just twisted anything else for the final and last time clarify this energy that's on the table anything else to clarify the energy that's on the table yeah with them making past it yeah, trying to stop this person. We got free stop spells. We got escape. Yeah, they don't want this person to escape something or escape them or whatever. We got, yeah, like I said in the beginning, they're, what these people, this energy is, or these people coming in by the twos or together, whatever, they is for their own personal victories. And they quick to criticize any and everything that the person does because that's whole that's a whole part of the um you know what this playing in this person's energy is. Yeah. I see going down the rabbit hole, so definitely something about that is significant. What else to clarify this energy on the table? Everything that I've been saying is coming out from my from my basket. Yeah, we got Bay before anyone else. Hold on a minute. All right, so something about this is just, yeah, that's what I'm getting. We got temptation. So they definitely been trying to temptate this person. These was on the floor. We got endangering the welfare of a child. We got not in the best interest. And then we got trying to control, wow, another one's personal love life. So these people with this vengeful energy, they could have been definitely trying to come in this person's energy to control their love life but something about this person taking whatever these these um intentions these offers is is not in their best interest to do that because it's a lot of playing energy like trying to see how far they could do something and see what where they're going to get it to go or if they're going to be able to get this person to to um to take to be a part of this or to do this or like maybe this person might have um was more like I said more open to things in the past or you know now I'm not gonna say they was like totally like just out there but they was more open to things and like now that they're not is really irritating and bothering these people you got water sign energy Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio that I see that talks about emotions, matter of the heart, relationships, spiritual connection, and intuition. I definitely feel like this person has some intuition about this. And then something about the water sign energy could be significant. Yeah, these people been planting and plotting 
this person's demise in, in, in some kind of sense of the way we already seen um excuse me we seen bad health and despair we seen thief we got vengeful suspiciousness and i said um many man by 50 cent wish death yep so it's like they could have even been wishing you know that on the person we got wants to send love gestures to you for no reason yeah but it's really playing in this person's energy like to just to see what's on this person's mind and see what they can get away with or see what they can do yeah yeah i see loss all right, anything else to clarify this energy for the final and last time? Hopefully nothing else won't fall on the floor. It's like this person just wants to have a peaceful vacation, but these people keep, you know, in some kind of sense of the way this person just wants to have a peaceful vacation. These people keep coming in to try to, um, yeah, but something about these plan or whatever it is, it has a leak in it or it has more than one multiple, more than one leak in it. Yeah, we got social media drama. They could even been even been causing social media drama with this person. We got owl. I see that talks about dark magic, un unconscious mind, um, being able to see in the dark. So somebody could actually been doing some dark magic with this energy. Yeah, they go current past again. Yeah, something about liar, 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 drama, causing this person drama. All right, anything else for the final and last time to clarify this energy that's on the table? Ooh. We got the letter K. So now we got SK. SK or KS. So something about them two letters is significant. Wow. All right. Let's see any other. Oops, some other stuff going on the floor. Hold on again. All right, so what else went on the floor? It says anything do is never good enough. Yeah, they make this person feel like anything they do is never good enough. Um, definitely people around this person and they're coming in their energy could be making them feel like that. Because they're emotionally detached. Like whatever they do is for their own personal victory. We got spring that came out. We got model, a male model, something about a male model insignificant. We got all parties involved where we see bad karma. We got um, break generational curses. So they could even be coming in towards this person because um, they know that this person has been trying to break generational curses. Yeah, this is not a coincidence that this has been going on. Yeah, something definitely came and passed. All right, anything else for the final and last time? Yeah, they know this person been working overtime or these people been working overtime to do something. We got a leader. They feel like this person could be a leader in some kind of, kind of way. That's why they also could be doing this. Yeah. Anything else to clarify this energy that's on the table? Wow, something about a governor, mayor. Senator, senator, uh, senator is significant. Excuse me. Yeah, they're always on this person. There, this these people is always thinking about this person. We got always on your mind by SWV. Yeah, subliminal messages. Like I said earlier, yep, high school mentality. Like I could just keep going, and the, you know the cards is gonna come out. We got something about one, two, three, four is significant. That talks about, so this person been like a new spiritual path. Um, it says new spiritual path, reward for hard work, and success is coming. So this person's been on a new spiritual path, and these people in this community or, or whoever's coming in by the two, uh, with their own intense personal game, playing games, all this playing energy, childish energy, they don't like that this person is on a new spiritual path. Like it's, is making them feel uncomfortable in some kind of way. So they keep trying to do things to uh, come at this person in whatever kind of way. We got 2022 could be significant. So I see that sticking out. I also see um, it's going to be an uproar. Like something about this could be causing an uproar. About them keep trying to, you know, come at this person like this. Let's get a few cards from this deck. You know, this, this is more like a... Uh, 
which what I want to say, twin flame type of deck. So let's see. Can we get like three cards from this deck to clarify this energy that's on the table? We got um unsent messages. It says won't admit their true feelings. Uh, won't admit their true feelings, think about reaching out, but is apprehensive and then does not uh, types a message or picks up the phone, but never hits send or dials. We got Aquarius. Aquarius talks about, well, this side is, um, it says, I acted like I don't care, but I did. I just needed my time and space to think on my own. I didn't want to be tied down by a relationship because I wasn't ready to put in the work. And then we got drinking the Kool-Aid. Uh, it says, listen to others and disregard and disregards their own feelings. Knowingly goes along with other people's plans and ideas without thinking of their own well-being. Somebody definitely was going along with some kind of information or whatever. Yeah, because they know that this person got some kind of destiny or whether they got a destiny with um, with them or somebody else or however this goes. But destiny, it says you were destined to meet strong, unbreakable bond, passionate love and strong desire, deep inner knowing or of divine connection. Like I said earlier, when that X came out, so something about an X could be significant. Or something about SKX could be significant. Now that I think about it, S S K X. Wow. And then we got regret. Yeah, somebody is in regret. It says, I think I made a mistake. I should have never let you go. I should have stayed and fought for our connection. But I was weak and fearful. Now I'm here mourning over your loss. Yeah, because they know that this person that, you know, they're not taking these offers or whatever from these people. They could be reinventing names, re reinventing themselves in some kind of way. We got re reinvention. It talks about metaphors, meta, meta, ugh. metaphors. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Metaphors of mind and spirit changing oneself into something better. Working on shadow aspect and becoming aware of strengths and weaknesses. So I feel like that's the most best person you could be or can become if, you know, you're willing to take that time to go through the dark night of the soul and and, and be able to deal with yourself, be by yourself and everything. And, um, you know, put in that shadow aspect and that work. To be more aware of your strengths and your weaknesses. Yeah. Anything else for the final last time to clarify this energy? Oh, what was that? Yeah, we got in um fragment of the soul. It says I'm working on my self-worth for my self-worth. For a long time I deemed myself as someone who didn't deserve love and happiness. I always I was always angry with my life, pushed love away because I thought I didn't deserve it. So I feel like this could be part of the weakness that this person is working on. But these people that's coming in with these these vengeful intents and whatever like that, they don't like it that this person is, you know, working on their self-worth and, um, you know, working on their aspects of their strengths and their weaknesses. These people don't like it. So they want to come in and dis disturb it with all this plain energy or this childish energy. All right, so let's go ahead and close this out. I can't wait so I could get some more decks because I feel like I could have used some other decks, but I just don't have every you know the ones that I really want or would use right now. But I'm working on that. So. Let's use this deck to close this out. And go ahead and upload this. Let's get like a card. Again, something about S, K, and X could be significant. All right, we got family. So something about family is significant. 
which that gave me the energy of community. We got colds in nature. Like I said, this person could be getting signs. So this person could be getting signs from nature and signs from uh, numbers and synchronicities and all kind of stuff. And we got spirit act. So spirit is acting um, at this time to help this person, to navigate this person. Yeah, whatever, whatever this is going on in the metaverse, we got witch metaverse. Yeah, so this person is, so this person can work on their legacy. We got conjuring legacy, followed by great uh, Osan, Osanian, Osanian Grace, Urzuli, pay attention, truth, aura, and compassion. So all of these was at the back of the deck. I just want to keep going on the floor, but I'm, I'm catching them. So all of these is at the back of the deck. We got Conjuring, uh, Grace, Pay Attention, Urzuli, Truth Aura, and um, Compassion. So I feel like the Spirit is giving a lot of compassion for this person right now because they know this person's their true aura. They know this person's true aura. And I feel like um, this person has been paying attention to their aura and their their child divine energy. And like I said, with them uh, putting their, their time and work and their energy into like, you know, their shadow, you know, the shadow aspects of their, um, their strengths and their weaknesses. Because, you know, like one of the best things is I feel like I've learned is when I had to come back to like being by myself or like even now just being by myself and, um, you know, learning myself again, like as as if when I first had to, you know, go out on my own as far as living on my own and stuff and trying to navigate that and figure that out until I end up like getting to dealing with um that of the opposite sex uh, opposite sex I feel like that kind of like uh threw me off track you know so and was like a distraction was a major distraction so now that I have been with myself um you know taking the time to like regain and rebuild up my myself in different ways and I and I um I'm not I don't feel like I regret it or there's no need to regret it because I'm I'm seeing and um seeing a lot of things and learning a lot of things so definitely um open my eye up to more than what i feel like open my eye up to more than even before but anyways this is going to be the end of this reading in this video all right so if you're not already subscribed to the channel you're more than welcome to subscribe um I will continue to upload videos to this channel at my time and discretion when I feel the need or the want to um, again, subscribe if you really want to subscribe and watch the videos, like the videos, watch any other videos on the channel that you that you want. Uh, and I'll see you later and I'll see you in the next video.